Here is my worry. What polls show and what studies have shown is that for whatever reason, Democrats are more likely to use mail-in ballots. Republicans are more likely to walk into polling booths on election day. It is likely that the first votes that will be counted will be those people who came in on election day, which will be Republican. And here is the fear, and I hope everybody hears that. It could well be, and, you know, I don't know what's going to happen, nobody does, but it could well be that at 10 o'clock on election night, Trump is winning in Michigan, he's winning in Pennsylvania, he's winning in Wisconsin, and he gets on the television, he says, thank you Americans for reelecting me, it's all over, have a good day. But then the next day, and the day following, all of those mail-in ballots start getting counted, and it turns out that Biden has won those states. At which point Trump says, see, I told you the whole thing was fraudulent. I told you those mail-in ballots were crooked. And I got, you know, we're not going to leave office. And we were getting ready for a big celebration. We, we were winning everything. And all of a sudden, it was just called off. This is a fraud on the American public. This is an embarrassment to our country. We were getting ready to win this election. Frankly, we did win this election. We did win this election. So our goal now is to ensure the integrity for the good of this nation. This is a very big moment. This is a major fraud in our nation. We want the law to be used in a proper manner. So we'll be going to the U.S. Supreme Court. We want all voting to stop. We don't want them to find any ballots at 4 o'clock in the morning and add them to the list, okay? It's, it's a very sad, it's a very sad moment. To me, this is a very sad moment. And we will win this. And we, as far as I'm concerned, we already have won it. So I just want to thank you.